Ansible Role and Collection Testing with Module, elevating Ansible development throughout systemic testing and interactive refinement in molecule scenarios. Molecule, the testing framework for Ansible Role and Playbooks introduce powerful functionality throughout its concept of scenarios. Think of a, a scenario as a test suite of, for a role or playbook within an Ansible collection. This guide delves into molecule scenarios, their layout and how to harness their capabilities for efficient testing and development. Adding molecule to an Ansible collection is a a process that enhances your development and testing workflow. Start by creating a directory within your collection named Extensions. Navigate to this newly created direction using the command line and then initialize a new default molecule scenario. But I already created this content that came with a standard Ansible Creator Collection scaffolding that basically are some very basic uh, testing scenario. And we are going to deep dive on this together. Bear in mind that uh, the scenario layout is crucial for organized molecule testing components. So they create, destroy, molecule and converge YML file are very important to understand which test is performing in which moment of time. We're going to have some unit tests, some integration tests, all the tests that we need to do it with different versions of Ansible that guarantee the quality assurance of our uh, collection and role to the final user. Welcome to my terminal. First of all, we need to verify that Molecule is correctly installed in my system. In my case, we got a command not found. I'm on a macOS operating system, so I can use a Homebrew to install this package. The installation is super smooth and, as you can see, it doesn't take a long time. Now, the Molecule command line is available in my system. Let's verify we have the latest version installed and is taking advantage of the current Ansible. In my case, it's using Ansible 2.16 on Python 3.12, taking advantage of Vagrant 2.0. So, this is the configuration and uh, uh, using the molecule command, I have access to all of this series of testing. As you can see, the help is pretty straightforward. It just listens the uh, molecule heads in the development of Ansible role. And here we have all the type of check that we can perform. There is a check, clean up, converge, create, dependency, destroy, drivers, hidden potents, init, list, login, matrix, prepare, reset, side effect, syntax, text, and verify. Some of these are command to actually uh, initialize our instance. Inst an instance is uh, a, uh, a virtual machine that is going to cre be created and used for actually performing our test. And all the other are the way of performing the test. There are different ways. The most common is the converge test, that is one of the most, uh, um, one of the best. But also the hidden potence test is very important to guarantee that the code is not actually harmful on the target machine. Now let's create our first test scenario. Adding module call in our Ansible collection is a straightforward process and enhance our development testing workflow. So first of all, we need to locate our collection. So let's move inside dot Ansible slash collection, Ansible collection and foobar. This is my test collection. And as you can see, these are exactly the file that were previously shown in Visual Studio Code. Okay, the uh, extension directory is the new directory that uh, we need to interact with Molecule. We're going to use the Molecule init scenarios uh, to set the foundation for incorporating Molecule into our collection, allowing to seamlessly integrate testing and development practice. 
This NIO layout is crucial for organizing the molecules testing component. Within the molecule default folder, several files play distinct role. Create YML, this playbook file, create instances and store data in the instance config. Destroy YML contain Ansible code for destroying instances and removing them from the instance config. Molecule YML, the central configuration entry point for molecule per scenario, allowing configuration for each tool for testing role. And Converge YML, a playbook file invoking your role. Molecule use this file with Ansible playbook to run against an instance created by the driver. Ok, now we have a default directory structure with Converge, Create, Destroy and Molecule. So, the next time we launch Molecule, we can select a, a, a single test, for example Converge, to execute the Converge file and so that uh, this message on the screen. This is an effective test. Yes, this is just a scaffolding uh, code that need to be actually modified with an actual test for your Ansible role and collection. But this is the point, or we can run a molecule test to run all the bunch of tests automatically, systemically on our collection. In this way, as you can see, we did all the possible tests. And let me highlight with for you that we started, uh, uh, let's start from the beginning. We got a, a First of all, a syntax test, then we create an instance, we prepare uh, the Ansible playbook, we execute our Converge test, tested for hidden potence and any side effect, verified and clean up. This is exactly all the type of testing scenarios that Molecule can execute for us. You can see that this is a very powerful tool because uh, if we execute systemically every time we commit some code, we have absolutely guarantee that we are not going to introduce any error in our code. Now, you might be wonder that code was just too generic, so let's explore using our, Ansible, uh, our Visual Studio code, the code. Uh, the molecule default directory. As you can see, there is a create YML that is just a simple way, uh, file that creates our instance for our code. As you can see, this is just, uh, there is some scaffolding code, as well the destroy one that is actually checking the instances and delete the old one. On the molecule YML, we can configure what type of platform we would like to check uh, for example, there is uh, the CentOS stream, but we can extend it using a different distribution and different version. But the most important file is the Converse test. Now, doesn't look familiar? This is an effective test. That was exactly the test that we saw on the screen before. Imagine that here we can test the code of our Ansible role and also performing some tests, not destructive. Um, as uh, in the scaffolding, um, w there was uh, some example of a converse test. This is more what it looks like uh, when we are going to do an integration test for an Ansible role. As you can see, we are going to include the code from a role and do some static test on it. So this is an example of converse test that is actually working. So we just need to take inspiration, copy and paste this code, make some slightly adjustment and we are good to go. We have a molecule, we have all the converse test and uh, now the sky is the limit. This collection is actually uh, getting better and better. So here we can include all the resources that we need to propel our future. I'm super excited for this newest collection. Can't wait to hear your success.